For Lord Jesus said, from the beginning of creation, God made the male and female. And therefore a man shall leave his father and mother and hold fast to his wife, and the two shall become one flesh. And so they are no longer two, but one. Welcome, friends and family, to this joyous celebration, as we have the great blessing of being witnesses to the marriage of Madison and Studstill and Isaac Joseph Domney. Dear Isaac, today I am going to be standing in front of our family and friends and make the most important and easiest promise of my life. I am nervous, excited, and most importantly confident, knowing I have found the one God has made for me. I'm ready to see how you will lead me in our future family, and I have no doubt you will do it with such strength. I love you, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life getting old with my best friend. I will see you at the altar. Love, Madison. I've known this day was coming since I met you. Cannot wait for this wedding and the rest of our lives together. Madison, you light up every room you walk in, and everyone you meet is better because of you. You are the perfect person for me, and we're going to do some big things together. I know this week hasn't been perfect, but there is no one else I'd rather be doing it with. You have worked so hard on this marriage and wedding, and you killed it. You make me want to be a better man every day, and I love you. This is just the beginning of our story. Walking out of those wedding doors into the rest of our lives is going to be a blast. Thank you for all that you do. I love you. I'll see you at the altar. Isaac. But really, you do ground me with your realism and honesty. You encourage me in all I do. You amaze me with your work ethic, and most importantly, you push me in my walk with Christ. I am just thankful the Lord decided to make us sisters. Being known as the Stead Sisters throughout high school and college has been just such a joy. What I like about Madison is that she makes my brother happy. Madison's awesome, and obviously I've gotten to know her a lot better over the years. She started coming home with Isaac to Orlando to visit. Um, and there's just a lot of things to like about her, and a lot of things that made me realize that, man, she's just perfect for Isaac. I'm proud of the man you've come, and I love you. And Mom told me to say that so you can take it or leave it. But no, no I, really, I really do. I'm, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of all the hard work you put in to become a police officer through the police academy. Yeah. Especially in times like this, that's something very admirable and, and something I'm, I'm ridiculously proud of to say that my brother is a police officer. Isaac, will you have Madison as your wife to live together as God has ordained in the holy state of matrimony? Will you love her, cherish her, in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to her as long as you both shall live? I do. Madison, will you have Isaac as your husband to live together as God has ordained in the holy state of matrimony? Will you love him, obey him, honor and protect him, in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to him as long as you both shall live. I do. Take you, Madison Ann Studstill, to be my wife. I, Madison Ann Studstill, take you, Isaac Joseph Dominey, to be my lawfully wedded husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. I pledge before God and these witnesses. To place your good above mine. Now and always, no matter the circumstances. I promise to honor you, to love you, and to cherish you. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. Joyfully and willingly. I commit myself to you, and you alone. I commit myself to you alone. Isaac and Madison, we have witnessed the pledging of your commitment to each other. We have seen the sealing of your solemn vows of marriage by the giving and receiving of rings. And now it is my joy and privilege to declare you husband and wife. Hold on. <laughs> what God has joined together, let no man separate. So Isaac, you may kiss your bride.
the Lord put this together. Everybody, everybody knows it. This this couple right here have really, really sent a, a message to us all that we can persevere through a lot of things and we can still come to a final conclusion and have a great, great wedding together as a family. I'm just so happy that each and every one of you came today. I want you to enjoy yourselves. I want you to have a great time. All right? All right. Isaac, I just want to tell you, thank you for loving Madison so well. I think we can all agree today already has been just the most perfect and beautiful day. I mean, just look how great Madison looks. She's the perfect bride. <laughs> Congrats to you two. I love you both to the moon and back. Can't wait for lots and lots of nieces and nephews next year. Yeah! To Isaac and Madison, may they have a long and prosperous marriage. Take a shot to start it. Let's go. Oh, oh. Let's go. Let's go.